questions all the time about how do I stay organized, how do I stay motivated, and uh, my answer for all of it is I have a list of to-dos, I have a calendar, um, I use it thoroughly, um, and I stick to it. Especially when you're driving, if things are just going through your head, like I need to do this, I need to do that, I pulled out my phone right now, and with my voice command, I just notated all the things that I needed to do. Um, I lost my I lost my wallet the other day, so I have to order new ID. I have to order new cards. Um, I have to call New York Life about some life insurance policy information. I need to figure out coaching schedules. I need to see if backpacks are ready to be picked up. Um, my sister is coming into town tomorrow, actually, and it was a spur of the moment. Um, we're going to have a big garage sale, so I have to get ready for the garage sale. Oh, I need to add that to my list. I need to order sign or make signs to put around the neighborhood. So I just wanted to let you know that the way that I help prioritize my life, because it's all over the place, is I make lists. I make to-do lists. Um, and I make a schedule. The work, my workouts, I make it a priority. I know that I have to work out from 11 to 12. Well, you better believe I'm not gonna schedule anything from that time, and that's only during summer break. Uh, when I'm working, if I know 100% that I'm gonna go home and I won't get up and go to the gym, then don't go home. Take your clothes to work and go straight to the gym. Me, I know that I can go home, take a nap, um, a 30 minute nap, wake up and go to the gym and I will be fine because I have put myself into a routine. Um, and then also routine is very important, especially if you're working and, you, and you're trying to do time management. Having the same routine and sticking with it is very, very helpful. Okay, well that's it, bye. Sweet. Is that it? They're gone. 
Okay, so my mom has everything imaginable. Everything. Derek and I are taking my TV back. Take y'all to our... Are y'all ready? I can't sell this. What? Don't sell it. Okay, this is just a little <laughs> bit of... So we got vases, tons of everything. Clothes, kitchen stuff, clothes. I'm selling him too. So much stuff. These are really cool, I might keep these. Hey guys, so I've had a very eventful, long weekend. I am like 10 shades darker than when I started. I think I'm even a little sunburned, but it's okay. Um, we are on day two. I think we're almost done. Actually, I wanna be done. I wanna throw everything away. We still have so much stuff. My mom has so much. Um, I wish I could just like sell stuff over the internet and just like, you know, give it to you. I can't. It's so hot. It's 100 degrees in San Antonio. And this is everything that we still have. My mom loved Christmas. Jewelry, sunglasses, tons of kitchenware, shoes, more kitchen, so many clothes. Derek and my dad are, I don't know, they're building, they're building a trench or something in the house. Caked in sweat right now. How did the garage sale go, do you think? I feel like we didn't sell anything. <laughs> but we sold all the things. It looks like we did. We sold lots of things. That's right. That's true, though. I feel like it's true. We did not... I feel like we didn't sell a lot, but we did sell a lot. Hello, YouTubers. Oh, do you want to say hi to YouTube, Winnie? Hi. This is my beautiful stepmother. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> I never let Ashley put me on here. <laughs> Okay, that's enough. We've been working nonstop. I got to go to the gym yesterday. I wanted to record, but I put it on Snapchat. Um, I couldn't record because my camera was dead. That's why I haven't recorded anything. Um, it's been really emotional. Been spending a lot of time with my family. My daddy has been busting his butt helping us out. Look at how handsome he looks in his shirt, Lululemon. Oh my God, speaking of, I ruined my shorts. <laughs> what is that? Permanent marker. Oh. I thought I had the cap on it and I was just pounding on my leg. Ew. So I got I want this plant because I'm going to Hey, so that I want a plant. I mean pot. I mean, I'm trying. <laughs> Let's be honest. What are you going to plant in it? Remember, where did you take the left? You have to put rocks at the right. bottom of that. Why? So the soil doesn't fall out of the bottom. I'm telling you that I don't have a green thumb. So I have to put rock. Why? So the soil can yeah, so not go the, through it. So the water the drain, can go through amazing, it and right? then drain out the bottom. So it doesn't puddle on the bottom of the yeah. soil. And timber, more. timber trace. Yeah. Isn't that what the hole's huh? for? Right, but you're supposed to put rocks in the bottom. So drainage. Do you have to do that with even smaller plants? Yeah. I do. All of them. What? Yeah. I just painted new plants and I didn't know that. That's fine. Those are indoor oh, plants. Now you know. That's fine. Oh, but outdoor plants need it. I mean, both All need it, plants. but yeah, too much. Uh, okay, I don't want the, the pot library. anymore. <laughs> I don't want the pot oh, anymore. All you have to do I is change my mind. You have to find rocks from your yard. I don't have rocks in my yard. You have rocks in the front of your yard, right by your door. Oh, you're right, I do. <laughs> they came with the house. <laughs> they came with the house. They're free with the house. Chef Sammy's making waffles. Did you what was that? Four fat, nine carbs, less than one protein for a tablespoon. Okay, so the way that I like my Kodiak cakes, of course, is half a cup, a little bit of, I usually use almond milk, um, and then two egg whites, and then I add water so the consistency is kind of watery. And the best part, that you have to put the morsels in at the top because then they get stuck and burn at the bottom. Oh, look at, look at who's making a cameo this morning. Mm. Mm. <laughs> it's too early. 
Okay, so I take it back. This is the best part. I'm gonna use honey peanut butter on top of my delicious waffles. The grocery store didn't have Walden Farms when we were there, so I'm gonna have to eat waffles without syrup because they have sugar-free, but there's still 11 carbs and I don't wanna use those carbs. Oh, good morning.